So our classification system consists of five classifications. A1, which is general patronage. That means this is a movie for everyone. Uh, there's absolutely nothing objectionable in this. The only exception to that would be we might warn that there are characters in peril so that really little kids might be frightened by the movie. But if there's anything the least morally objectionable, then it doesn't get an A1 because really we're saying this is for all age groups. So those would generally these days tend to be cartoons and things like that. A2 is adults and adolescents, so obviously adults and teens, but not little kids. A3 is adults, and that means grown-ups only, although occasionally there'll be a film that's sort of in a gray area between A2 and A3. And what we do in that case is we give the A3 classification, but we note in the text of the review that this might be acceptable for some mature teens. So we're not endorsing it for them, but we're saying some parents may feel that there's really nothing here that they're uncomfortable with their 17-year-old seeing. The next classification is L, which originally was A4. And L stands for limited adult audience. So that is an interesting category because it can cover basically two things. An artistic movie of considerable aesthetic merit that grapples with gritty material, stuff that the average casual filmgoer doesn't want to really engage with. And so there's that aspect of the L. The other aspect of the L would be a bad movie that simply isn't so bad that we tell everybody not to see the film. So we're saying, this isn't quite bad enough for us to really classify it as an O, which is our morally objectionable, but be warned that it skirts with that. And then the final rating classification is O for morally objectionable. And that's the modern equivalent of the old C for condemned. And you'll see that there's kind of a verbal shift there. Condemned means we condemn it, whereas morally objectionable means we perceive in this something morally objectionable. And so that essentially is our telling readers, do not see this film. This is not acceptable from a Catholic perspective. Mm -hmm.